Hey guys, Ben here from Surf Clinic, just giving you the report for the weekend. Looks like quite a massive swell. Saturday is going to be 10 foot and 11 seconds, which is big waves. Um, with that period, it's going to be well overhead high, probably double overhead on the beach, maybe slightly smaller on the reefs. Uh, Sunday is a bit smaller at 7 foot and 11 seconds, so it's still going to be head high plus on the beach. Um, and the reefs are going to be maybe shoulder to head high. Um, all down the coast is going to be massive, so you probably want to be on the beach in the hinge. Um, tides are good as well. It's high tide early in the morning, late in the evening, so you can pretty much surf from 9 right through until 5 o'clock on Saturday, and from about half 9 until 6 o'clock on Sunday. So both days are wide open. Big issue really is the wind. It's looking like um, onshore, 20 mile an hour, 25 mile an hour onshore all weekend which means all the waves are going to be um, walls of white water. Quite hard work with the wind, um, but loads and loads of power. So good waves for beginners and improvers working on getting to your feet, riding across waves. Uh, I put this down as a work weekend. If you're improving your surfing, come down, get stuck in, work on skills, waiting for that good clean day to come later on. Um, you won't be getting out the back. It's way too big um, if you're an improver. Um, there will be a few options on shore, maybe Cornish on the reef. If you're an advanced surfer, will still break through, so it won't be too bad. Other than that, um, looks like get your head down and put some work in on your waves. Okay, have a good one, and uh, we'll see you next week. Cheers. Oh, and thanks to Jeff and the guys for coming down last weekend. He gave me a great uh, report on the, on the videos. He's really enjoying it, so I'm glad somebody out there is watching. Cheers. Bye.